Hey guys and welcome to Wars of Scale. So you know me, I am trying to be as honest as I can, and Rai Cream so far has not performed very well when it came to my tests, which I do every once in a while, testing AI copywriters against six parameters. And if you have access to my dashboard, you, you can see that Rai Cream scored 2.7, uh, which was in fact the lowest score there was. But something happened a few weeks ago. One of the Right Cream representatives approached me and asked me to do a review, which I denied at first, saying that I already did and I am not recommended Right Cream as of now currently. But they were very persistent, saying that it is in fact Right Cream 2.0, even though it's not an official name. And a bunch of new templates have been developed, which caught my attention, and I decided to run the experiment one more time. And since I never recorded a full on Right Cream review, I'm recording one now. So here we go. Right Cream is a AI tool to generate blog articles called emails and voiceovers. In terms of popularity, Right Cream is still a fairly niche product, even though it is comparable with some of the more popular tools like Creator AI or Niches. And we can see that Rye Cream has a better, larger following. When it comes to traffic, we can see that it, even though it is a niche product, it is experiencing well over 300 and in recent months, well over 400,000 visits per month, which is huge. And uh, as far as pricing options go, you can have Right Cream forever with the limited capabilities when it comes to word count. You can have unlimited version for 29 monthly, standard extended, but depending on when you're going to see this video, they also have a, an app sumo deal available, which is actually a nice value for money because you get a lifetime deal with unlimited words for only $59 as a one-time payment. So this caught my eye as well, and I think this is something worth mentioning. As far as templates go, I've counted 45 templates and they have some pretty amazing ones. Like you can have a voiceover created within this, within this tool. You can have a LinkedIn icebreaker when you feed the system a LinkedIn URL and in return it will create a customized response. You can create your own tools, but I haven't messed around with this yet. But uh, what really caught my eye and what were the representatives from Right Cream saying is that there are three new templates that we want to test and talk about today, which is image generation, chat genie, which is more or less the way chat GPT works, uh, with the one very important exception, which I'll talk about later, and the instant article writer. And this actually what skewed me to and what pushed me to do rerun my experiment because previously I was using the article, the four step article writer, and uh, this template here produced very poor results. But now they have the instant article writer, and you use it like in wordplay or auto blogging. So you literally type in your topic and you press a button, and voila, you have a full article with intro and conclusion. So let's see Write Cream in action. So once again, when you go to the, the dashboard, you can see some of these newer templates here, like the image generation. And I'll type something very simple. Generate a photorealistic line. And you can download it straight away. Nice. But let's have some fun while we can. And another template that caught my eye was the Chat Genie, this one here. So this is like Chat GPT. And let's ask it to write a prompt for a photo realistic line. Let's click send. Mm -hmm. Let's try this. Let's go back to the image generation. Let's paste this over. Let's hit generate again. Wow. So much better. And we can download it. We can regenerate it once again. But I like the second one. And this is a clear winner, at least for me. Looks very nice. 
So let's go to the Chat Genie. This is not going to be a Chat Genie tutorial, but I wanted to tell you something very important, which is the fact that this Chat Genie is connected to Google. So if you were to ask Chat Genie, what's the price of Bitcoin today? It will not return this response that ChatGPT does, like my database has only been trained up to 2021 and blah, blah, blah. And ChatGenius says the price of Bitcoin is 16,716. And let's just ask the same ChatGPT just to confirm. I'm sorry, but I don't have access to current cryptocurrency prices. Okay, fair enough. Let's try perplexity and ask the same here. What is the price of Bitcoin today? And the price of Bitcoin today is 16,837. And here we have a very close number. And the reason the numbers differ is because they have different exchanges. And depending on the time of the day and the exchange, your Bitcoin price may vary. So this is one of the biggest advantages of Chat Genie over Chat GPD, for example. Let's see if ChatGenie has some of the ChatGPT capabilities that we that we love, like generate an HTML script. For a mortgage calculator. Nice. If only I knew how to copy this. Maybe we can inspect the elements. I have no idea actually. <laughs> Should have prepared better. And just the final test, let's uh, ask it to write an article about how to manifest a car. And this is your article. Manifesting car can be a difficult task. Has some points here. By following these steps, you'll be very well on your way. So it didn't take long, and it's a nice addition to the template family of Write Cream. And yeah, the third template that again made me redo my experiment is this one here, which is Instant Article Writer. And you can see that I have generated some of the outputs already, but let's try something new. How long does it take to become a doctor, for example? So guys, I had to wait for a while, uh, in excess of 10 minutes, I think, and it would have been nice if a right cream had a progress bar. But here is the output for how long does it take to become a doctor. We can see that it's 1700 words. This is an intro. Becoming a doctor is a dream many people have. It's a profession that requires a lot of hard work, dedication, and intelligence. And these are the headings. What is the process of becoming a doc doctor? What are the necessary requirements? How long does it take? It can take anywhere from four to six years. What are the odds of becoming a doctor? And the, the odds are one in 25,000. What are the possible complications during the process of becoming a doctor? And what are the benefits of becoming a doctor? What are the possible risks of becoming a doctor? What are the possible costs of becoming a doctor? And here we have a cost. What are the possible opportunities? Conclusion. And as far as the quality goes, and as far as exhausting the topic, I think this is very robust and this is very detailed. And I had a similar experience with other outputs. They were very well compiled. And let's now head back to the presentation and see how Rycream performs against other top tier copywriters. And so uh, this is how the Rycream 2.0, again, not an official name, scores right now. It's within the uh, first tier 
uh, AI copywriters like Wordplay, like Word Hero, like Autoblogging and Jasper. It's not outperforming them, obviously. What you have to take into consideration is the current price, which is minuscule, and the amount of original different use cases templates. And here it is. Here how the worldwide cream performed against the top tier copywriters, like again, Jasper, Autoblogging, Katab, Word Hero, Wordplay. When it came to the word count, right cream 2.0, which is the instant article. Uh, here, um, surprise me. So it out outperformed the average by quite a lot. So almost 2000 words on average. As far as the output quality and, uh, just for transparency's sake, here is how Raycream performed before all these new templates and developments. So before it, it was just over 500 words. Now it's almost 2000 words. The output quality, again, it's a bit lower, but this is my subjective view. It's a bit lower than the average, but again, right cream, the previous version was nowhere near this new and improved version. Plagiarism score is around, it's a little bit higher than the average. Readability score is on par with the average. SEO score is a bit lower, but not by far. So all in all, we can see that Riot Cream is up there with the top tier copywriters, but there is one caveat, which is the originality score. So no matter how many times I ran the originality score against Riot Cream outputs, it's on average it scored less than 1%. So this is the average for top tier, 30% originality. The Riot Cream, uh, the first version, was uh, less than one tenth of a percent. And Right Cream 2.0 with all the improvements is still below 1%. So if you want to be on the safer side and if you believe that this is something that will be punished in the future, you need to rerun Right Cream outputs with different spinners or use some of the methods that I described in some of my videos. So all in all, for the price of $59 for a lifetime deal, I can recommend this tool. If you are not comfortable with it as a copywriter, you can use it for its templates uh, and again right cream has very unique nowhere else seen templates so here we go guys i'm being extremely transparent i did not recommend right cream before i am recommending it now maybe not as a full-on copywriter but as a collection of different templates that have very unique use cases hope this video was helpful subscribe if you haven't already like share and i'll see you next time